Hey, what's going on, everybody? I'm McKeon, and in today's fix of entertainment news, the Morbius movie got nominated for a few awards, Misty returns to Pokemon, and Hot Wheels is getting a movie. Let's drop it. Shout out to Jared Leto and the team that brought us the Sony Marvel classic Morbius as the movie has received five award nominations. Worst Director, Worst Picture, Worst Actor, and Worst Actress at this year's Razzie Awards. Now for those unfamiliar, the Golden Raspberry Awards celebrates the worst in cinema. Now while the film was indeed a critical bomb at the box office and didn't move the needle amongst Marvel movie fans, it resonated on a different level in meme culture. Now the movie went on to be ironically praised across the internet with many memes about Morbin time trending across social media platforms. Hell, even Jared Leto got in on the action when he posted this video of him reading a script to the vampiric sequel. What are you reading? Uh, nothing. Nothing really. Just, uh, no, 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 no. Now, Jared Leto seems to be in on the joke, so, you know, maybe he'll be in attendance at the actual award ceremony to accept his worst actor award if he wins, of course. Now, the competition is steep in the worst actor category with Machine Gun Kelly for Good Morning, Pete Davidson in Marmaduke, Sylvester Stallone in Samaritan, and Tom Hanks for Pinocchio. Like, that's some really, really tough competition there, and honestly, they all should win for their performances. Now, who do y'all got taken home the Razzie for worst actor? Who do you think is the best of the worst? Comment down below and let's discuss. In other news, Misty is returning to join Ash in his final days as the main protag in the Pokemon series. Now that Ash is a Pokemon champion, the water type trainer decides to visit Ash and challenge him in a Poke duel. Now at the time of this video, there's about 11 more episodes in this anime's current run with Ash, and it'll shift focus to a new protagonist. Now, this was quite the reunion as both Ash and Misty appeared in the very first episode of Pokemon back in 1997. Now, Brock is slated to return as well, rounding out the original Pokemon trio, sending Ash out in style. Actually, I also have to go back home right away. <laughs> I got an email saying I had to go back and take care of some errands and stuff, and I almost forgot. How could you forget something like that? Uh, I'm not sure exactly. And finally, Mattel is racing towards a Hot Wheels movie with WB and Bad Robot. Now, writers Dalton Lieb and Nicholas Jacobson Larson will be writing the script for the film, which will be adapting the 54-year-old race car toy franchise. Now, very curious what the movie will be like and if Mattel is trying to build its very own MCU. Mattel Cinematic Universe. Now, we do have the Barbie movie set to release this summer, so, you know, maybe we'll see an end credit scene with Ken doing a loop-de-loop -loop, you know, on one of those uh, orange race tracks in his tiny whip. Who knows? I don't know. Really wish Mattel would just work on a Street Sharks movie. That'd be pretty damn sick and honestly more interesting than a Hot Wheels movie. He sends a competition to a watery grave. Boom! Death. Now, do you agree? Let's talk about it down below. And that was your entertainment fix for today. I'm Akeem Lawanson, and thank you so much for watching. Now that you're caught up on today's news, please check out our previous episode. Download the IGN app on all your devices, and for everything else, stick with IGN.